Hey everyone, it's Pixelade here and welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having an amazing day. So our brand new event rewards start this week. Now this time we have the Reaper's Rewards. The Grim Reaper is reaching out to you, but don't be afraid to answer since it seems grim wants your help. And the best part, you'll be rewarded for your efforts throughout the event with one being a brand new lot challenge, Scare Seek where sims will get excited instead of scared while on the lot. So how will it work? Open live mode with an existing or new household. After a short wait, the Grim Reaper will call upon you. The event will run for eight weeks with two exciting quests each week. Your journey begins by assisting Grim with researching Ambrosia, a special gourmet dish that can lift any sims's spirits. As the weeks progress, you'll continue to unlock the secrets of Ambrosia and eventually learn how to cook it. The more quests you complete, the more event points and rewards you'll earn. So in order to earn rewards, you have to make sure that you are online and logged in to your EA account. So things are going to work a little bit differently with the rewards. The Sims team has posted online via their direct communications Twitter account that the team is aware and is currently investigating an issue where players who participated in the Happy at Home event are missing their reward items. We are tracking this on Answers HQ and appreciate your patience as we investigate a solution for those affected. And we have talked about this previously before. Unfortunately, if you lost your saves or if you uninstalled your game or upgraded your computer or basically a dozen or more different things that could have happened to you, there's a pretty big chance you probably lost your rewards. And if you want them back, you're either going to have to download the ones that were already uploaded as CC package files, or you'll have to head over to Answers HQ, submit a ticket, and hope for the best. Well, the Sims team does reveal that they're doing things a little bit differently now with this latest Reaper's Rewards event. They write, tomorrow's Reaper's Rewards event runs on an updated system where claimed rewards are linked to your EA account. Account. Using your EA account, players can participate in the event without risk of losing progress or claimed rewards. Honestly, thank God. You know, I'm shocked they didn't do this from the start, though I do just want to say now that at this point, they should just make it so that after the event is over, whether if it's a couple of weeks after the event's complete, maybe even a month or two, or, you know, even if they want to wait longer, after a certain point, just give Give everyone everything completely free in a Sims Delivery Express drop. It's literally that easy. Not everyone has the time to log in all the time, trying to mold and bend around their obligations, school, work, whatever it may be. Life gets busy, I understand, and not everyone has the time to play all the time to claim their rewards. So, you know, it would be nice if eventually they just put it out as a patch for everyone everyone to download hassle free. And honestly, as far as the original happy at home login event, why even request simmers come over onto the forums or submit tickets? It's been a considerable amount of time since that event took place. And also we have a new one starting tomorrow. So, you know, you might as well just put a Sims delivery express drop out and give all that stuff to everyone to make up for it because it's only the right thing to do. It doesn't matter what console or what platform you're playing on, Sim from all over are reporting not having their rewards. One user writing absolutely lost mine on PC. PS4 player here, it's happening to me as well. All my rewards are gone. PC too. It's not hard to understand why they disappeared. The reward slash event item filter in build mode was disabled, most likely because of the lady death event. You hit it. With this, everything disappeared because it is possible to clone the objects. Lost mine on console 
loaded the game and my sim was bald after finally getting a decent straightened look. Yeah, I think the easiest way that they could sort all of this for simmers is to just put it in a Sims Delivery Express drop. Let me know down below what you guys think of this. And also let me know if you guys are excited for the brand new Reapers Rewards event. Here's a little guide on how exactly you can claim the rewards. You can do so either on the main menu or in live mode by selecting claim. And your rewards can be found in build, create a sim, or in your sims's inventory. Each week, two new quests will be available. Complete these quests to earn more event points and unlock new rewards. For week one, we have the Grimophone. Oh, I love that take on the gramophone. I mean, just looking at the gramophone had me pretty excited. I won't lie, but the little switch up on that is nice. Earrings of imminent demise. Scare seeker lot challenge. Tradgoth jeans. The green lady's lost tomb. Tradgoth buckled boots. Grimm's cruiser bicycle. Life and death tattoo. The portrait of Lady Mimsy Alcron Shallot in the garden. Tradgoth button up. A new spectral spritzer drink. This drink will turn your sim into a temporary ghost. New prowling peeper's eyes. And of course, the casket of quiet repose. And that will be it for me. Take care, guys. Happy life simming and happy Reaper rewards.